the Beatles bring out their own monthly something, monthly magazine or something? In that they are writing people to meditate. Any, anyone who meditates, and no, no matter, becomes better. And this Beatles thing was not due to Beatles, all this worldwide publicity. It was not due to Beatles. What happened was, before I came to London last summer, that is 66, summer of 67, July, I was told that for about eight months, the whole English press and English government and English clergy, all these church people and all the important people, whole education department, they were all worried for what they call drug mania of the of the youth. The children in the colleges, they're just drifting on to the use of these drugs. And many boys were sent to jails and very all counseling by the church and all kinds of things, but they, nobody could stop them. And there was a great national concern over this. I was to speak there in some, hmm, and that lecture, the Beatles came to hear. After the lecture, now in that lecture I found quite a lot of questions about drugs here and there and there. And I, I replied as I replied. Then when the lecture was over and the whole thing stopped, some man came from behind the stage and said, Beatles were listening to you and they want to hear you, they, they want to meet you. I said, tomorrow morning I am going to Wales, and it's already 11 in the night, so there won't be any time. But they said, but it's very important, they should talk to you. I said, when they can talk to me? Then he said, can't they come on this stage? I said, all right. Then draw the curtain. The curtain was drawn and I sat again on the stage. They came. I had been hearing some some word beetle from California, and I thought they may be boys, maybe 10 years, 12 years. <laughs> but here came the, came the boy with mustaches and all that, and then the man who came before he introduced, these are the beetles, one, two, three, like that. Then I sat and talked to them for about 15 minutes, and I said, you have created a, a magic attraction in your name, so you should do something for the youngsters. They said, we want to do, tell us to do, what we, and we'll do. Then I said, first you experience this meditation, and then try to become teachers. They said, we'll do everything, we want to experience, tell us now. <laughs> I said, now it's 12 o'clock, you must be feeling sleepy. <laughs> I'll be in Wales for three days, and but I said, you don't have to come there. You, there are about 20 teachers in London. <coughs> yes, well, you can say. Then they said, no, they want to uh, learn from me. I said, okay, then come there. Then they followed me. There were some pressmen uh, listening to our talk from uh, behind the curtain. And the news went around with the press that the Beatles will be going with Mahashi to, to Wales to start meditation. And it was a long journey, so uh, they took me by train. When I came to the platform, there were about 50 cameras from 50, uh, the, all the international press were there on the platform. And they said, where are the Beatles? They, I said, I don't know. Last night they talked to me, they, they would come with me. They may be in the train or where. And uh, as I proceeded to the compartment, all the, the, the press rushed on to the the backside, there the Beatles were coming and all this. This was because the English press, being very intelligent, sharp, they, they took the this opportunity of Beatles following me for a big publicity to change the psychology of the youth. Mm, the, the, the reason for this worldwide publicity was uh, that deplorable situation in England for the last eight months. And, English, and when English people gave it a big headline, it was uh, that uh, 
deplorable situation in England for the last eight months. And, English, and when English people gave it a big headline, front cover, then the world press followed. This is how it came about all this <laughs> Beatle story in the worldwide media. It was not the Beatle, but it was the situation in the country. Immediately, in two, three days, this, hmm, this Archbishop of Canterbury came out with a statement congratulating Beatles for starting Transcendental Meditation and all. Hmm? There were big, huge writings just to change the psychology of the children. And they succeeded greatly. So this was, uh, this, this 